Let's get it started now. The basics are a crucial aspect of any discipline. I'm counting on you, but you're back into it! How's this? Brilliant! Dancing is quite a complex art. I'll strive for further heights. Way to show some passion for once. Nice dance, Nato. Hey, I got the Kanji Nauto Fever Trophy. Thumbs up! The excited shadows dissolve into beautiful eyes they cheer, fading back to where they came from. Not bad, Nauto-kun. Maybe she signs. Maybe she signs when it comes to a real show, or she really get it, or she really got into dancing. But she expressed, fuck, <laughs> she expressed herself with much more ease than in practice. Can't talk. Can't play. Everything's going to hell. I did it. I've still got a ways to go, but I managed to make them understand. Wow. She's cool. No, you mustn't let their poison take hold, Misery. That's it! I'm fed up with all your crap! What's your problem, anyway? If you've got something to say, then come out and say it to my face! <laughs> Why, though? 
what did we got to? You and I are getting along because we're not hurting each other, right? Why not keep this comfortable distance? What? You call all that getting along? You were anything but nice. Oh, but I want you to be happy now. As a friend, no one gets hurt. Everyone is happy. That's what this world is about. And we've been saying no, it ain't. How the hell do you think we'd accept you without even seeing your face? If you really want to be friends with us, then get out of here right now! <laughs> my, my. What am I to do? Nozomi, do you think you can stand face to face and talk with them? Huh? N no way! Surprised by Nozomi's sudden outcry, we all turned towards her. No way? What the? Nozomi! What are you saying? Right? It's okay. If you push yourself, you'll just end up getting hurt. Nozomi-san, please calm down. Don't fall for its trap. Uh, but... but... <laughs> I'd appreciate it if you didn't bully Nozomi. She has a big performance coming up. Hearing that, we all gather around Nozomi to defend her. That's right. It's just like when Samomo was taken away. We won't let you have her. You caught us by surprise last time, but now we're ready. What a wasted effort. So, Nozomi... Damn it. Hey, you! Don't listen to a damn word it says! Huh? Wh why These people want you to show them the real you. <laughs> what a horrible thing to ask. Don't you agree? If you do as they say, you'll have to go through a lot of pain and suffering. Are you up for that? No, I'm... That, that's too much. I can't... The moment Nozomi lets out a bitter cry, ribbons rip, whip out towards her from all directions of the room. We bolt, trying to put ourselves between her and the ribbons and block the way. But me, Naoto, Kun, Teddy, and even Kanji's knocked back by the thin ribbons, like we weighed nothing at all. Damn it! Kanji Kun! No ah. ah. protect Nozo! Blow! <laughs> Blow! Ah. Nozomi! Nozo chan! Before I can get back on my feet, Nozomi is pulled away, tangled in the coiling ribbons. All that remained was silence. Fortunately, no one was hurt. We quickly get up and look towards where Nozomi vanished, all blaming ourselves for the outcome. No! I couldn't protect Nozo-chan! This is exactly what we wanted to prevent! It seems those ribbons are impervious to any use of force. Come on, guys! We've got no time to mope around! We'll go after Nozomi as soon as we're ready! We never give up, right? Just like our pal John Cena. Right. Well, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> You're turning out to be a rather strict leader. Much more so than you, Senpai. I'm with you, of course. Don't forget Teddy. I learned from you guys what it means to have an enduring soul. Nothing can beat me. All right. We're saving Nozomi. We can do it. Tell me Agreed. Go. What's this? A stage? It's like a musical. Our chase after Nozomi leads us to some place like a castle-themed theater stage. I don't need to search for Nozomi's reading. Kanji points forward, calling out urgently. Hey, look! Over there! That's Nozomi, right? N no That's not how I... <laughs> I'm surprised you're putting up a fight. But I'm afraid you don't have a choice. Or, are you willing to show everyone how you really are? That's... that's why I... I've been trying to talk to people and... Is that right? But doing so hurts you. Who's the one crying all the time because things never go the way you want? Who... who are you? How do you know... You've always been like that, huh? Afraid of people's gazes, afraid of people's words, afraid of people. Why hurt yourself? It's not necessary, Nozomi. If you just play your part, everyone will adore you. The 
is no need for the real you. Nobody wants her. Nuzo-chan! Nozomi! Raise this on. We rush to her side, but Nozomi only looks at us with fear in her eyes. No! It's just like what happened with Samomo. Nozomi's practically given into that voice. <laughs> Come on, Nozomi. You get nothing out of trying to be yourself. Just pain. You can be great without any of that. Think about it. It's so easy for you to interact with people when you're that Nozomi. Am I wrong? Here, listen to everyone. Nozomi has an unusual appeal. She's a cute girl with the attitude and dependability of a cool guy. Ah, these voices again! Are these Nozomi-san's fans? You know, the best part about the whole Prince Charming thing is that she isn't self-conscious at all. It takes a lot of guts to be that self-assured. Even if people laugh at her, she's strong enough to ignore it. I'm not strong at all. I... I can't do it. See? It's the confident, uninhibited Prince Nozomi that everybody wants. As long as you cling to the real you, life will be filled with pain, sadness, and fear. No. No, I, I don't want that. <laughs> Suspended above the stage by the ribbons binding her body, Nozomi glances towards us, sorrow in her eyes. I don't think she can glance at us if her eyes are covered. We try our best to get to her, but the ribbons bar the way. Uh, hey, you! Don't give up, damn it! Nozomi, no! I'm scared. It hurts. I. I. Yeah! This is the same as Momo chan! How could we let this happen again? I'm a giant picture now. <laughs> yes, this is how it should have always been. There's no point in life if nobody cares about you, is there? Of course it's better for everyone to accept and desire you. Oh, this is the greatest feeling. Now, I invite you to join us. And connect with this bond as well. The eerie chills suddenly roar behind us. Cheers, not chills. I don't need to turn around. It's got to be another audience of shadows. I stand facing towards the monster that swallowed Nozomi and shout. That's not right, Nozomi. It doesn't matter if people want you or not. The real you is never worthless. We idols aren't dolls. It's our job to work hard so those who see and hear us will accept us. Listen to Reese, you idiot! Greatest feeling! You know damn well you're lying to yourself! Yeah! After I met Sensei, I got unsure about who I was, so I had to think and think real hard! And now I'm the adorable bear I am today! It hurt a lot, and I felt miserable, but because of all that, I know just how important my actual self is! So don't say things like there's no point in your life! I can't bear to hear that! Watch me, Nozomi. I'm going to prove it to you right now. We don't have to lose our identity to be idols. <laughs> 